Hello. 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 Howdy. How y'all doing? Uh, commercial first. If y'all could like, comment, subscribe, that would be awesome. I am uh, looking to get more subscribers because when I hit uh, 1,000 subscribers, I want to give away guitars. So the more the merrier. Join the family. Um, and you don't have to be assaulted by any music today because I keep forgetting that I, I had uh, purchased this. I trolled Goodwill and I purchased this thing. Um, and th this is actually pretty cool. It is not uh, the scale length of either a Gibson or a, uh, a Fender. Um, I tried to use my handy dandy guide here and could not because it is just not the same scale length. Um, using all the tricks that yeah, I was taught before I got one of these. Um, it, the, the neck looks look pretty straight actually so um, I don't think there's there's anything that needs to be done with the neck I'm not even sure that there oh there's a truss rod cover so yeah um, this thing is pretty cool actually because uh, it again it looks like it's just dirty it looks like it just needs a little love um, this these right there's no switch because this is a volume and this is I got to get inside. these electronics are like froze man um, I, I am able to turn it with a uh, with a needle nose um, so these are two volumes um, the electronics do work I have plugged it in but there's only these uh, with the four strings that came on here and it sounds like poo so you know I don't want to assault your ears with that because uh, these strings are super old too but I think what I'm gonna do is I think I'm gonna see if I can uh, you know get the uh, get the strings off here see about uh, how level the frets and stuff are and see about the little you know crown and polishing blah 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 um, cleaning it a, a lot and then putting some strings on it and the, oh yeah the electronics I got to do something with this here and I th I might have another knob around here somewhere um, so I'm hoping to reuse one of those and uh, if I do have one hanging around here and uh, we'll see what we get but uh, yeah I think this was like a $30 guitar um, so it, it was a it, it was a pretty cool deal I you know just trolled um, went out and trolled Goodwill and uh, yeah, I do that every once in a while. I knew what you got to, on Goodwill. What I, I have to, I don't like paying these ridiculous shipping prices. So you have to, before I, I start even looking and trying to bid on any of these things, I look at the shipping prices first just because I, I don't want to pay, you know, $25 for a guitar and wind up paying $75 for shipping. To me, that's just stupid. So I, I make sure that the shipping and handling isn't uh, isn't so extravagant. And the guitar is actually worth it for the for what they want to charge me for shipping and handling. That's how I look at it. But uh, uh, other folks might see it differently. So you know, I, I just have a big problem with the shipping prices these days. It's like uh, Harley Benton's. I, I seriously want to try them, but uh, the uh, uh, Tomain, to, Tomain, uh, Tom, Tom, the the German site over there, they they will totally ship it to you. But to me, the, the shipping prices are just ridiculous. Yeah, you can get a $125 guitar that is supposed to be good. Um, I don't know yet because I haven't tried one. And uh, But, I, I, you know, a $125 guitar with a $145 shipping charge to me just is not really worth it. So is, it's like when, when I can find the shipping prices that match with me, then I go with it, which is why uh, uh, that's why I you got to troll um, Goodwill because a lot of things I just refuse to pay at shipping because they're ridiculous. It's like from Tacoma to here, eighty dollars. Really, are you people nuts? When I can get it, yeah, something shipped from South Carolina here for sixteen fifty. Uh, I don't get it, you know. So um, just the, the whole the whole spectrum there just blows my mind. Anyways, I hope you all is having a great day. I think I did the commercial at the beginning, uh, and uh, I hope you all are having a great day. I got through my stuff today. Uh, they they came and looked at all the stuff and did what they need to do. I, I guess I maybe medicated myself very well this morning because uh, got up and started taking marijuana. And when you get up in the morning and start taking edibles with your coffee before your coffee, uh, you know your day is kind of be weird. So my day has been a little bit weird. I hope your day is a little bit better, a little bit more coherent. And uh, always look up. Here's Erfie, and I will uh, I'll see you then. Peace.